Hi Taurus, welcome to your mid-month, September mid-month reading. I am Lorianne, your intuitive guidance counselor, psychic medium, here to give you all the messages that I receive for the next two weeks of September. We're looking at the sun, moon, and rising sign of Taurus. And we're going to look at love, career, finance, family, health, friends, whatever information I get, I will relate to you. So let's take a look at the main messages. At the end of the reading, you guys, I will pull from the Romance Angel Oracle as well as additional advice that may help with a positive outcome. So, what? Okay. All right. So. We've got, starting off with the Nine of Wands. This is us putting a lot of energy and effort. And, and when we're talking about wands, this is passion. This is actually enjoying moving toward. It's a lot of work, though. It is. I'm not kidding. It's a lot of work. It's a lot of struggle to move toward what we're passionate for. Sometimes we have to release the old in order to uh, let the new in, which is difficult. So whatever you've been doing, whatever you've been working on, it's been a lot of work. You're doing a great job. You are almost done. You're almost ready to, to stop with the additional stress and burden on you. Now, the Two of Cups, this has to do with creating a beautiful partnership, a union where you and another or a, a, an entity, so to speak, that would be a business. And I do see this in a business partnership. Some of you have started a brand new business with somebody where I believe they're really putting a lot of the weight and the burden on you. Now we have the emperor. This is a person who is very good at leading great troops, right? This is somebody who can lead a, a lot of people in a very strategic, a very controlled manner to produce a positive outcome. The, like the emperor's really got it going on. <laughs> like the emperor's groove, right? <laughs> so... This may be your partner. And I say that because this type of energy can be very much egotistical. They're difficult to compromise with. They don't like to compromise. They're very stubborn. They can be very stuck in their ways. Why? Because they are exceedingly wise. They truly have a lot of inner knowledge, a lot of inner wisdom, and they base everything by that. So they can be very unwilling to compromise. So you may be dealing with a person right now in this situation to build this business that isn't really physically, maybe not even financially, but they're not helping you. They're holding back. They could actually be a silent partner. Now we have the Knight of Pentacles. This is a very slow moving energy. All of the Knights in the Tarot are about forward movement. This particular Knight is very slow because they plan things. They organize things and that could be why you're a little bit worn out. Like I said, you've been doing the work, you're planning it, you're organizing it. For some of you, your partner, like I said, they may be more like a silent partner contributing, funding whatever this is. Actually, for a big group of you, this is an offer coming in. This offer is from a person who's going to help you fund your business. You may have had a lot of challenges finding the financial backing to get this creation, this passion that you've been working so hard on in your career sector. This could be a hobby, but you know, for most of you, I feel this is an actual business. For some of you, this is a partnership with a very large entity. Um, it could very well be in the government uh, arena. It's very large. For another group of you, it's not government. It feels international. It's, it's huge. And you get this opportunity, this offer, and it's going to lead you to, wow, a lot more income. 
you're coming in at a higher level so you may have been on a lower level uh possibly lower level management i see this as middle management but it comes with a large increase and this offer is going to come in in the next two weeks yes two weeks for that group of you we also have the four of wands this is going to help you really build a stable foundation for your your family so you're going to have the finances that you need you're going to feel safe and secure and for some of you this is actually a person coming into your life after you've been through a lot when it comes to relationships you've done a lot of work trying to heal and grow yourself as you move forward you're going to meet a brand new person and this new person may be your true other half your true partner you're going to feel very connected to this individual and they are very grounded energy so they are looking for somebody that they can slowly move into a solid commitment but there is love here whoever this person is that can lead to a, a higher level commitment to a solid relationship to a union celebration marriage right for some of you you are dealing with an actual twin flame we have the energies of the struggles of the strife because you have to clear out all of your cobwebs in your emotional closet and so do they and it can take a while and I see that this has been taking a really long time now what I'm seeing for this particular group of you they're coming for the part of you they're coming more toward the last week of September rolling into the first week of October they're going to come in and they're finally going to say, well, first of all, this is an apology for whatever you've been through with this person, whatever it is. Just the waiting can deserve an apology. Yeah, this is, this is somebody who really recognizes that it does take energy and effort to work on a relationship, a partnership, a union whether this be in career or actually in the physical romantic or any kind of relationship anything we do in life if we want to be successful it takes a lot of energy it takes a lot of work it takes a lot of passion that's putting our heart our passion and our soul into what we've been dreaming about moving forward in that opening up this business getting this beautiful uh opportunity coming in to create a partnership a union that's going to bring you the funding that you need for this business and i do feel a sense of silence silent partner with this person so they may just be a silent investor that's it and they want to see the reports and make sure that everything comes through so they get theirs but you've got a lot of work to do on it you do recognize that but this is what you've been dreaming about some of you since childhood most definitely and some of you this person may be a family figure a, a parental figure that you hold in high regard they're going to help you fund this they're going to be very supportive whoever this person is and the person of the past they do recognize this is a twin flame situation definite beautiful soul deep soul connection telepathic communication the real telepathic communication they know there's a lot of work that needs to be done they've seen you in in their dreams they do recognize this connection now so this is them coming in and it's taken a long time they've had to go through a lot of release of the ego is what i'm hearing to come forward some of you this is your current partner you're in a relationship where your current partner is very stoic and i feel that it well see yeah there's a lot of hurt and betrayal attached to this individual a lot of hurt and betrayal in your past which is why you're having you know you're feeling so exhausted because it's been a lot of work for you to overcome this but you've done this work 
And this work is leading you to this beautiful new opportunity, this beautiful union, partnership. For some of you, I actually see whoever this person is, whether it's your current partner, your past partner returning, or somebody brand new, they have a deep connection to your true life purpose, to your career. They can help you grow in your career. And you already know that. Yeah, you've been waiting a long time for this, the Three of Wands. So you've been waiting a long time to heal this situation, to hear this apology, to get this offer. Been through a lot. You've been through a lot, Taurus, and you are literally letting go of that over the next two, some possibly rolling into the third week of the month, of, I mean, the uh, first week of October. <laughs> I can't talk. I like this energy because this is so positive. It really is coming out of what you've experienced in the in the past and it's going to lead you to feeling so grounded in your life so stable things your career your money is going to feel stable your love life is beginning to go in a direction of permanency of stability itself so it's very beautiful energy and right now i'm going to pull a romance angel card and i'm going to pull an additional advice card when it comes to these scenarios okay any additional advice so let's see what they want you to know keep an open mind your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectation so the angels are definitely bringing you i know my autofocus kind of working they're bringing the two of you together and i know you've been waiting for this for a really long time and it even clarifies it with this card this has been a lot of work, a hard road ahead. Whoever this person coming in, whoever you're dealing with, this emperor to you, keep an open mind because they may be very different than your usual type, just like it said. They might be a complete different look than you're usually drawn to, but take us and stop for a second because who you're usually drawn to has led you to this. The Ten of Swords. So give this person a chance. Whatever took place, miracles happen every single day. They do. You saw it. You've already seen it because you've already changed many things in your life, many of your beliefs. So let's see what's coming because this is beautiful energy coming through. Really positive forward change and a pick up a little bit more speed and momentum is what I'm feeling energetically definitely toward that last very last part of September so we have <clears throat> honesty I can't always expect the truth from others but I can expect it from myself this is holding yourself in high regard being honest toward what you're passionate about toward who you're deeply connected to being honest when they come in with this apology with this offer with this opportunity being honest in what fulfills you because you've really grown you're not going to tolerate anything that uh, makes you feel this type of negative energy this is leaving this is turning into the ace of swords the new beginning you've been waiting for this truthful information to come in and it is arriving it truly is and i think it's going to make you very happy this is positive happiness and joy opening up emotionally starting the beginning stages of a of a his mine and ours or let me say there's mine and ours right yes i love this energy you guys it's lovely 
So, uh, I do want to say readings, I did open them up temporarily. They're available as well as a discounted uh, intuitive guidance session. You can click the link below and that will take you over there. Have an amazing, amazing next two weeks, Taurus, and much love.